folks, it's time to go beyond buffets. It's time to go all the way down to Hugo's cellar. So let's see what this award-winning steakhouse at the Fremont Street inside the Four Queens in downtown Las Vegas has to offer. So this is usually not our price range, but this time we had a lot of comps at the generous Four Queens Casino. They pay you six times more cashback and comp than the Stingy Caesars and MGM on the strip. So we decided to go all in. So gentlemen, you don't have to buy the rose yourself because Hugo knows how to treat a woman right. Because every lady who enters the cellar is greeted with a long stamped rose. They are open daily from 5 to 10 p.m. Reservations are highly recommended. And what you can expect here is a dark but romantic atmosphere. One reason why Hugo Cellar is so special compared to other steakhouses in my opinion is that it comes along with a huge selection of sides which are included to the main dishes for example like Hugo's famous table side salad which is table side made for your wishes. They ask you every single ingredient if you wanted it in your salad or not. So you will get a salad which is just made for you. But hey, talked enough, let's get some of this wonderful black Angus beef. We ordered filet mignon 10 ounce for the lady, New York strip of course in 16 ounce for me. So let's start with some included fresh baked breads and once again I was fascinated about their love to the detail because the butter came of course in a rose shape. The breads were really gooey but the butter could have been more saltier for my taste. And for those of you who like it dry there was this interesting cheese lavosh bread. The made to order table side salad was one of the best salads I ever had. What an experience of freshness. You see this colored little tomatoes which were so sweet. Never tasted something like that before. I put in some onions, croutons, mushrooms, shrimps and to round it up some cheese. Forgive me I forgot the name of the dressing but it was really refreshing. And another great love to the detail was this little sorbet, I think it was raspberry, to bring down the taste buds before we go to the main beasts. And here we have it, the main beast, the 16 ounce New York strip, a wonderful piece of the short loin from a cow. In some areas it was a little work to go through the muscle, but all in all it was a fantastic piece of meat which was cooked to perfect medium rare. I was really pleased with the included sides that come along with the steak. I had some lovely mashed potatoes, wonderful grilled vegetables and some really delicious mushrooms. But now it's time to take a look at the other plate. What we have here was the 10 ounce filet mignon bad boy. I call it the perfect piece of meat. I mean, can you see the juice? It was absolutely made to perfect medium rare and this piece of meat was definitely better than mine. And on those special days there's one thing you keep in mind forever. It is great service and what the waiters did here was a fantastic job. They delivered the perfect experience for a romantic dinner for two that you won't forget. They had a feeling for being attentive when you needed them and a great intuition when you need your alone time. Even the borderless sauce was included. Detail after detail, like in a good airplane, they handed you this hot towel to get the hands clean. And as I promised folks, there is more, there is even more included into the detail. There was this huge silver plate with this giant chocolate dipped strawberries which were really fresh and sweet. Additionally, you will get some baby figs and some apricots. And hey, don't forget to like yourself and put this one deep into the cream. Yeah. Target moves? Yeah. 
This is cheesecake? Yes, sir. And? Cheesecake. Okay, we take this one. Yeah, thank you. And for those of you like me who never could get enough, there was this impressive dessert table which they pushed back and forth through the cellar and I couldn't resist, I had to order this more than delicious chocolate cake. I mean it was so chocolatey, loved the cream and the ganache had the perfect fatty richness. So you guys, let me know what you think about Hugo Cellar. For me, it was an impressive fine dining experience here in downtown Las Vegas. A place where they put so much love to the little things. A great value overall. Of course, it's not cheap, but for those special days in the year, I think Hugo delivers the fantastic experience. Thank you and take care.